Today, I'm going to show you how to get rid of this pop-up in Among Us VR. This will allow you to click around in other apps while playing Among Us VR, so you can use the soundboard software just like in my videos. The first thing you need to do is make sure you start your computer, and then once it's back on, shut it down again, then turn it back on, then shut it down again a second time, and turn it back on. I know it's confusing, but if you don't do this, the glitch won't work. I don't know why. It's super weird. All right, the next thing you need to do is make sure you have three virtual desktops open. To do that, click the task button down here, and then you should see all your apps you have open here, and then in all the different desktops you have, you will just have one. You can use click, click the button twice, just make two more, then go back to your first one. Then open Steam and Steam VR. And then make sure you have Desktop Plus or Access Overlay set up and working on it already. And if you don't or you don't know how to do that, I, I have a tutorial where I set that up. Then open up any other app you want, like the Smord Board or your recording software. Alright, then once Steam VR and everything's open, open up Among Us VR. Now you need Among Us VR to be in windowed mode. So if it's not, press Alt and Enter and that'll window it. And then you want to go back down here and click the Task button again. And then drag the Among Us VR window down into Desktop 2. Then click on Desktop 2. Then click in the Among Us VR window. Then click the task view again. Delete desktop 3. Make a new desktop. Then drag the desktop in between the two desktops. And then click on the main desktop again. Then click somewhere in Steam. I like to click right there because it doesn't open up anything. Then after that you need to go into your headset. The next I'm using XS Overlay. But you can also use Desktop Plus. But what you want to do is you want to create a new overlay. And then set the source for that overlay to the Among Us VR window. Then when you do that you should see your main desktop stays the same. And the Among Us VR pop-up should go away. Next, close that extra overlay you just made, and you're good to go. If your desktop did switch to the one with the Among Us VR on it, that means it didn't work. It just happens sometimes, you're going to need to shut down your PC and try again. And sometimes you have to go through the entire process, including the restarting and stuff. And once it does work, you can use your PC like normal. You can click around, open other apps, change audio devices. Just don't close Among Us VR, Steam VR, or switch desktops, as doing any one of those things will reset it, and you'll have to do the glitch over again. 